Evil can be defined, but it's hard to pin down. Simply put, an evil person is someone who engages in malevolent behaviors. Some argue that they're immoral, sick, depraved, or wicked, but those words are hard to define. Immorality to one is normalcy to another. But when you meet an evil person, no amount of questioning definitions will change your mind. The truth is, you will know it when you see it. Evil people come from all sorts of places, often ones you wouldn't expect. We find these bad people at our schools, in the homes of our friends, everywhere we look. Here are some warning signs of evil people. 1. They enjoy the misfortune of others. The malevolent ways of evil people often leave them so twisted and turned around on the inside that they feel good when they see misfortune. It might be a disaster on the news or a dramatic situation in front of them. They seem to delight in misfortune, to relish the bad feelings of other people. All the times that an evil person has been hurt in their life falls away when bad things happen to other people. The real danger here is that they could create bad situations for you and others in their life in order to enjoy the misfortune they create. It is important to recognize who they are before terrible things happen to you and the people they love. If horrible things happening is all that can help them feel better, you can't salvage or save them. 2. They have control issues. Evil people have this in common, they're controlling, but it's not all about controlling you. They often feel downright uncomfortable and powerless if they aren't in control of every aspect of their lives. Malevolent people are often so cruel to the world and to the people around them that they can't entrust any part of their lives to another person. Because of this obsession, they can come off as polite, concise, and punctual. But when you let them get closer, they start controlling your life too, making you just like them. Defying the wishes of an evil person doesn't always result in outright evil actions back to you. It may feel subtle, not a slap to the face, but a kick to the heart. The goal of the evil person is to control the way you feel on the inside, not how you feel on the outside. 3. They are habitually dishonest Let's be real. Everyone lies, we all do it. Some are little lies, others are big, big lies. But while everyone lies, not everyone is a liar. A liar is a real special breed. They lie pathologically, constantly, and sometimes without even realizing it. An evil liar will often lie so much that their lies are what form their reality. In living in a life of lies, their own minds become prisoners to their own evil behaviors. Some evil people only lie a little bit, maybe stretching the truth to make themselves seem stronger, smarter, or better. Some evil people lie about you and others, but one thing is for sure, they are liars. The lies serve as a tool to manipulate a reality for the beliefs that serve them. When caught in a lie, they will probably try to gaslight you, make you question reality as it is, and make you continue to look to them as a source of strength when all they really are are liars. 4. You feel strange around them It's been pretty well demonstrated that each of our bodies emits an energy field. Why that is, we're not totally clear on. It could serve as an intuitive defense system. But in the same way that you eat bad food, it shows on your skin. If you're evil on the inside, it shows up in your energy field. This might be why evil people give you a creepy feeling without them actually having done anything evil to you at all. Who they are on the inside can be picked up in their subtle energy field by your energy field. Oftentimes, one of the surest signs of an evil person is that you just don't feel right about them. You get creepy feelings and can't quite put your finger on it. You might sound crazy to other people listening to you talk about it, but don't deny the way the evil people in our world make you feel. Trust your gut and don't worry about it steering you wrong. If you get the wrong sense about someone, apologize, but better safe than sorry. 5. They mislead you Controlling reality is what gives an evil person most of their power. In doing so, they're able to make it serve as justifications to their petty wants and desires. This is why evil people have a tell. They mislead you into thinking one way or another about them, about the people in your life already, and about yourself. This misleading can come in many forms, like misquoting, lying, or stretching the truth and twisting the facts. The end result is a world of their creation and a world that you have trouble understanding or believing in. This is one way to spot an evil person, especially a sly one. Look for ways they mislead others. If you see it, go the other direction right away. 
Six, they lack remorse. Let's cover what we've talked about so far. Evil people are controlling. They're liars. They delight in misfortune. They make you feel weird on the inside. You know the worst part about it all? They aren't ever sorry for the things they do and the way they make you feel. Evil people truly have no remorse. If you press them on the fact that they're unapologetic for their malevolent behavior and dark personality, they'll deflect, push it off onto you, and gaslight you into thinking the reality you know to be true isn't actually true. In reality, all they want to do is maintain their current quality of life by controlling you, and an apology would indicate fallibility. The evil ones in our world want you to see perfection to keep you wrapped around their fingers. Admission of fault would shatter that image they've carefully cultivated. 7. They are cruel So far, we've talked about evil people and the subtle ways they express their inner malevolent desires. Not all people like to be sly about it. Some choose to be outward with it, and one way they do so is through cruelty. This can come in the forms of getting into fights, hurting their loved ones, their spouses, their children, their friends, or even hurting animals. Evil people are often victims of the prisons they've built for themselves, which is why they take so much joy out of misfortune and pain. It dulls the pain they each have inside of their hearts, but that doesn't mean you justify it or stick by evil people. If you're with someone who expresses themselves in such cruel ways, find ways to get away as soon as you can. One day, they may push their cruelty too far and really do some serious damage. 8. They lack responsibility An evil person has no sort of moral compass. They'll do as they please and will never feel responsible for the pain they have caused to others. If they sense any sort of blame coming their way, they'll start redirecting it immediately. They love to shift the blame to others and have no understanding of what an apology is. They think apologizing is for the weak, They'd much rather make you apologize for their mistakes. 9. Their friends and family warn you A lot of the time, one of the first signs that a person is truly evil is if their friends and family issue you warnings. They might talk about an ex-boyfriend or girlfriend who ran from them. They might casually dismiss the problems with previous relationships and make excuses for the evil person in their lives. This is a sort of manipulation, but it can also be seen as a warning sign of impending disaster. In a sense, these people are telling you that something is wrong and that it's your responsibility to do something about it. Other times, the people in their lives will outright tell you that the evil person is not healthy and that you should avoid them at all costs. In either case, don't ignore the signs of a truly evil person, especially when people who supposedly love them are tipping you off about it.